everyone, just here to bring you another one of my um, junk journal kits. So this particular one is contained in a kind of um, file folder. Again, this has been inspired by um, the Angie um, videos that I've been watching. Uh, so it's tied here with this kind of net kind of trim thing. So if I take that off, There's a piece of fabric trim. Um, I should have got my tape measure, so let me just get that. Hold on a second. Oh, where is it? Okay. Right. So the fabric trim is around seven and a half inches, um, and that's just uh, backed with some cardstock to make it more kind of rigid. And it's got some lace trim and some pearl on there. And then on the front of the cover, it's got this gorgeous um, decoupage napkin of a patisserie um, image of a cake. And it says Patisserie Paris, um, and it's layered up with a book page and some uh, music sheet. And it's got some lace and some coffee stained ribbon. Inside the file folder, if I just zoom out slightly, still kind of playing around trying to get the best um, angle really for my video. I don't know whether anyone else seems to tr struggle with this or whether it's just me but constantly and every time I do a video it's kind of different to the last time. Right so <laughs> in here um, you've got a tag or a pocket. It's um, got a decoupaged clock face on it with a decoupage napkin image it's got a stamped image, a fabric flower with a pearl centre and some lace, some sheet music and it's all been coffee stained and distressed. So that's either a tag or a pocket on the page. And then in this side there is a postcard with a decoupage napkin. Love using those as pockets or tags um, on my journals. And then here we've got a little fold out booklet on this gorgeous buff coloured paper which has got a typewriter image and then it's got a decoupage napkin on there as well and then it just holds clothes with this little coordinating butterfly and it's just got a piece of um, sheet music paper there got some script stamped down the side and then you've got another fold out booklet this time it's just got um, some sheet music stuck across the top and this buff coloured paper again and then it's got a little kind of tuck spot here with this gorgeous postcard. So kind of bonus, bonus items, I suppose. Um, so that's in there. It's got some lace and some pearl trim. And then here you've got a little tuck spot. And behind there is a little image of a lady on some cardstock. And it's got a decoupage piece of the napkin. And they all kind of tie in and coordinate really nicely. And then on this side, there is this um, tag or pocket uh, for your journals. Um, it's got some uh, fabric there that's just been distress inked and some nap uh, napkin decoupaged onto it and a little butterfly and some sheet music. And then here again got a tag or, or a pocket however you wanted to use it. It says a moment lasts all of a second but the memory lasts forever. I think that was from K and Company um, stickers. And um, again, you've got one of those clock faces with decoupage napkin on there. And then here, again, some fabric, um, which has just been distressed, got some napkin decoupage on, some sheet music, and then just backed onto this buff colored card with some lace. And then here, some sheet music tag with a little hot air balloon got some lace and some of the coffee stained ribbon and then here finally a tag or pocket however you wanted to use it uh, in this gorgeous buff coloured paper with one of the postcards on there. So that's kind of the larger kind of paper items um, plus the obviously ribbon trim and then on the back held on with the paper clip which obviously you also get which has been rusted um, and just like that. Um, held on with the paper clip, but obviously you didn't see that because I took it off before you could. Um, is a little coin envelope with again a decoupaged um, cake image, patisserie image, 
and then just this closure which I saw somebody do on YouTube I think it might have been Michelle Scott um, and in here are various items Ooh, shake them out quite tight to get them all in there because then quite small um, you've got a piece of burlap with um, another piece of fabric over it and some lace and this fabric um, with a bird cage stamped on it and that's all been distress inked and it's just fastened with a safety pin there it has all been actually glued on as well um, but that can just be kind of either stuck onto your pages or safety pinned on then you've got this um, burlap with a fabric stamped image of the hot air balloon and that again has been coffee stained that's that and then another fabric item here is just some burlap with this gorgeous little heart again coffee stained that's that and then you've got some chipboard tiles so you've got this little rose another little tiny uh, tiny tile with um, a little rose paper there so it's those two and then you've got some painted chipboard tiles here so you've got a heart shaped one um, with a clock image and some script the Tim Holtz butterfly there and this globe from Tim Holtz with some script as well and these two have obviously got the decoupage napkin as well so the whole kit I've tried to kind of tie it in so that it all um, coordinates nicely then you've got one of those little postcards again a little vintage kind of Parisian advert one of these teeny frames which really love using those in my journals and then this gorgeous um, bird um, I think these stamps are artistic impressions or something I've had them for quite a long time don't tend to use them that much because you had to mount them but I have finally got around to mounting one so <laughs> that's the one I tend to use that and the lady that you saw earlier um, and then you've got this teeny butterfly there with some script and layered up with another one and then these two of my handmade butterflies that have just been cut out from sheet music um, and layered up they've been coated with a coat of Mod Podge to make them a bit more kind of rigid been distress inked and then decoupage napkins in the corner this one's got some faux Damonte trim in the middle and this one here has got some faux pearl trim there so you get um, all of the items there so it's 25 items in total um, you know plus obviously the um, kind of folder to contain it all um, so hope that you liked it uh, if you did please give me a, a like and a thumbs up and subscribe uh, thanks so much to all those people who have done so far um, and check out my Etsy store and my other, and my other videos on YouTube thanks ever so much cheers bye